You're beautiful, and that's for sure. This season, our Poochie girl is going to the gym, but she's going in high heels with a cocktail, no doubt. So we're using quite light foundation, rubbing that into their bodies, rubbing into their faces, and it just gives a kind of a darkness rather than a brownness, giving them a little bit of finish on the brows. Very, very minimal makeup. When they've got it on, it's kind of hard to see that it's there, which is great. Because it's not eyeliners and colours and lipsticks, it's quite subtle, but it is a lot of makeup. Hopefully, at the end, it will look extremely subtle and you won't be able to see it at all. <laughs> I like it actually. Yeah. Natural but different. That's great. Faith in me brings me to tears. The hair and makeup today is really cool. Hair and makeup is always like on point. Always a pleasure to be here. You don't know me that way, yeah, yeah, yeah. And though my love is rare, yeah, It's really natural and like really nice, girly. Today the hair at Pucci is tasseled. It has a dry texture, but it has that movement that it makes the hair very natural, and at the same time it gives that understated sexiness. What I use is I use in volumizing mousse first, and then, you know, it's like with one inch curly iron, I just do a little bit of movement, so it gives that touch of modernity. amazing but opening the show and putting that first like energy into it it's a great experience the details with the colors and the beading I can't wait to go to an event and wear one of those I was in Morocco in April and uh, and I just started sketching the silhouettes and the hoods and the jellabas and the sarwell trousers and all that. And it kind of started resembling athletic clothes. Another trend in Milan has been this like ultra luxe sportif. We had this, you know, the softened baseball jackets. We've seen a lot of use of sport materials like mesh but they've been done in only the way the Italians can do it, in the most luxurious iteration. I thought totally sexy, totally good. All this kind of amazing, sophisticated couture embroidery but taking a cultural thing and giving it an energy that only fashion can bring. Like it because it's spectacular. It's not like simple draws, like a lot of color. We have a lot of uh, models. It's gonna be a great show, and the location is amazing too. So I think it's gonna be great. Yeah. When I was there, I also found like Maasai jewelry, and so we started working on that in the embroideries, and it just became putrefied Maasai, I suppose you can call it. Beautiful. 
beautiful the all the print around it's hot it's comfy it's a really nice material i like it it's great Well, Pucci knows how to dress women. You just feel like a bond babe out there. All I need is like a gun on my leg and I will be like smoking. The mix of sport and Couture and Pucci and with a lot of Pucci prints inside is very interesting. It modernizes the story. I like it. Frankly, I like it. And if you want to be perfect for a party, but also that they wear, Pucci is okay. whether I'm fireman or I'm boxer. It's the best outfit. It's fabulous. The show is like good energy. I'm very, very, very excited to be here. It's like one of my favorite Milano moments. I'm wearing like a very sporty, cool boxer look. Boxer shorts and then like a big belt on top. I love it. Sports. Sports, but in a very, very sophisticated, incredible way. I think it's all to do with uh, wanted to show your body that you have one and sports is like the new 80s yeah i loved how street it was it was sort of like street but luxury um i loved all the girls coming out and owning the catwalk i like the scuba theme all the, like the scuba dresses with the zips and the shoes and yeah everything about it was kind of wild and wonderful and but always contain that Pucci, you know, woman, that Pucci idea, which is what Peter does so beautifully. I love the brightness, the color, very joyful. I love the sweatpants, uh, Sahel. I love the shoes, I love everything. I love Peter, I love his world. like um, we uh, have a need to show off all these great bodies that people are working on and um, I kind of like that take of sportswear for cocktails. Feels very fresh. As always, I feel uh, we are very sexy in Pucci. Today we are a bit sporty too. It's pretty cool, really beautiful. I wanted it to be easy and like all those like drapes were actually were actually neoprene bases with jersey just draped on them. So it really was that idea of just keeping something very easy going through. But of course, I do love working with embroideries and all, so it was kind of this Baroque minimalism in a way. I have 
a long black gown with sequins on the shoulders and down the sides, so it's very sexy. I think everything in the Fuji collection is like edgy, but very sexy still, so it's definitely my style, so I like it a lot. Well, they were also a bit sporty, you know, they had the racing stripes going down the side, but this time they were transparent, so they were more evening appropriate. It's a dress that makes you uh, straighten up. There's something very proud about this collection. It's very, very pucci, and what I like, it's presented very sporty but very refined at the same time. You can just have a sporty jacket and a beautiful pant and uh, you know if it's scuba, if it's beaded, the same attitude is there and it's sexy, it's modern, it's fresh. With the Pucci colors, with a lot of contrast, you put a black dress and you put a super jacket on top and it gives you that attitude and that makes it very wearable too at the same time. <laughs>